Um, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the I Play TI Global Girl Screams Week Five. To those that does not know me, call me Base Play Man. It's good to be back. We've been a bit busy with some tournaments that we hosted, but now we are back again with the usual screams, ladies and gentlemen. I Play TI Global Girl Screams are back, and this is gonna be the Week Five. This is gonna be the Week Five, and I'm pretty sure. Uh, all of you guys are quite excited because uh, we've had uh, we've had a, just because we had a couple of tournaments we couldn't host the usual rooms, uh, usual scrims exactly. So now we are back again with the usual scrims, and I'm pretty sure uh, you guys would just uh, you guys be you guys will definitely be with us throughout the entire series. And this is gonna be the week five, guys. So uh, the we'll be starting the room qu uh, quite shortly. So we've got. An Erangel room that is gonna come up next. Um, so this is this is gonna be the Erangel room, and we've got a couple of teams already here with us. So I'll just be giving a brief introduction to all these teams. Let's see we, what who we've got. So we've got team number two. We've got team Scott BD Seven IG Rebels. We've got team number five here, team Unicorns from Bangladesh. We've got team number six here. We've got team ORC Mermaids from Sri Lanka. We've got team number seven, team Gen X Girls. I think uh, there's a player missing here, but she'll. Uh, definitely come here uh, as soon as possible here as well. So we've got team 8 here. We've got team NA Invictus and we've got team number 9 here Team Max CG Angels and we've got team number 10 here with us team G Girls of Glory another Sri Lankan team um, Alongside the we've got team number 11 team MIG Angels actually that's a Malaysian squad if I, uh, if I if I'm correct and we've got team number 12 here. We've got team party We've got team number 13, another Sri Lankan squad, team WG Amethyst. We've got team number 14, team SDZ, Lily MV. That's a Maldivian team, I, I suppose. And we've got team number 17 here, team TMZ, uh, TMZ Hells Angels. And team number 19, last but not the least, team number 19, team B2F Esports. We've got 47 players here. We've got 47. And uh, most of the names are very quite familiar because... Uh, I've been here throughout the entire, I mean, uh, throughout the week, three, I think the third and the fourth weeks. So a lot of these names are quite, uh, quite uh, mem memorable actually. And the Sri Lankan um, names are obviously uh, quite uh, familiar to me. And also, uh, we've got, yeah, we've still got 47 and we'll be starting quite shortly as well. And it's actually, it's actually nice to be back guys. I'm pretty excited here as well. So I'm pretty sure you guys are as well. So it's. Uh, just because you know we couldn't, we couldn't host, um, we couldn't host the normal scrims, and we've got another player, we've got Annabelle here, and they'll be jumping in, they'll be jumping in uh, quite soon. A couple of players getting kicked off as well. I think I feel like uh, a couple of players getting kicked off as well. And something that I should remember, guys, uh, the room is in progress. Something that I should remember is, guys, um, make sure you guys. Uh, Make sure you guys uh, record the two minutes SR, uh, two minutes SR. This is a request from all the teams out there, and all the four members of the team should speak within that two minutes. So I hope you guys remember that, and uh, and you guys cooperate with us so that uh, this event, this scrim, is gonna be quite a success. So we've got, we've got a lot of teams, guys. We've got 49 players. I think everybody is quite ready. Everyone's warmed up as well. This is gonna be the first match. This is gonna be the air angle match. And uh, let's see, let's see what's gonna happen. Let's see what's gonna happen, guys. So, I think um, most of these, most of these, uh, it's, 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 it's most of these girls uh, we've got from uh, Sri Lanka. We've got a couple of them from uh, Bangladesh. We've got a couple of them from uh, Maldives as well. And uh, I'm not sure what's happening, but uh, yes, we're losing frames. Okay, we're back again, guys. We've got 17, 14. I think. Um, Let's see. Yes, so this is gonna uh, this is gonna be the total number of teams. Gonna be about 13 teams, and I'm quite sure the pl uh, plan route is uh, as expected, going from Primoz to Lipovka. That is a very very common uh, plan route, and I can, as you can see, guys, uh, a lot of these teams. I think the military base area is gonna be quite crowded. The Persian area is gonna be quite crowded, and the areas and the teams that are heading off towards Saki, Jojo, and all those respective teams. I I feel like. Um, I feel like uh, yes. I feel like if these teams, if these teams, uh, 
since the plane route is towards this way, I feel like uh, the teams that are going that has assigned drop locations to be Saki and Sevani might just have to uh, might just have to just basically take a vehicle and then rotate. Let's see what's gonna happen. We can see a lot of teams jumping over as well, and um, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys are quite excited. So jumping in, ladies and gentlemen. We've got we've got all these girls jumping in. We've got 13 teams and a total of 49 players and. Uh, uh, most of them, most of them jump into a school. I feel like uh, the drop locations for school and the apartment buildings are very, very common am among a lot of PUBG players. And I feel like that is exactly what's happening. A lot of these teams are jumping towards that area. And um, yes. So the weather's kind. The weather's kind of nice, actually. The Erangel, I think the Erangel scenic uh, weather's kind of nice. We've got a nice climate today. We've got a nice climate today. Everything is going good. I think uh, I'll be giving off the weather forecast as well. So uh, we've got teams. I think team number two. They are gonna split off and look for individual vehicles, and I think they are quite successful with that. So that is happening like that, and we've got. Uh, the zone set towards the quarry slash Primorsk area. I think that is uh, going to be quite quite beneficial because if the zone were to set towards somewhere like military base, I feel like it will be a huge disadvantage. I feel like it will be a huge disadvantage for that team. So we've got team WG Icon Katia, WG Icon Rena, WG Icon Scar, and Cleo Patrix. So that is going to be the WG Icon. Uh, I think that is going to be WG Amethyst. Mm. Is, this team is going to be WG Amethyst, so we've got uh, we've got a lot of teams still alive. I'm pretty sure it's just because uh, most of them are quite spread out, and a lot of them are going to separate, uh, going to look for vehicles separately. So we've got Ritu on live here. She's uh, doing some. Oh no, actually Minoli is doing the driving. Minoli is doing the driving. I think they're going off for a they're going off for a slow load process. They've Yes, they made it. They made it to the Jojo Apartments area. I think uh, Bonica B2R is quite hit as well, so she's gonna heal up quite soon. Uh, looking for consumables, and um, we've got BL Win Akira, BL Win Akira, Dor Dorami is here, and BL Win Akira. Yes, that's team team number 19. So that is gonna be team B2F Esports from India. So that's a three man, uh, three girls code actually. So I'm pretty sure these girls, uh, they know exactly what they're doing. They're just going in for that looting process, and it's gonna be a quite a slow game from the beginning. But I feel like when it comes to the later parts of the game, it will definitely be. Uh, when it comes to the latter parts of the game, it will definitely be uh, quite entertaining, quite exciting, because uh, as far as I've seen how things have been, as far as I've seen how things have been. Within the uh, within the process, I feel like a lot of these uh, a lot of these girls are very well uh, prepared for what's coming next. And just like I said, the climate is kind of nice. The climate is kind of nice, and all of these uh, team number twelve just rushing in, just rushing into the zone there as well. So we've got teams called BD Sonar G Rebels right there, team number two, and uh, we've got. Team, we've got two teams very, very close to each other, and uh, first blood getting drawn. I'm not sure where it is. Uh, I'm not sure where it is. I'll have to focus on. Yes, here you go. Lily MV Manji taking off face Daisy, uh, Daisy actually. Um, I'll be looking into that. There, I think she was quite uh, separated from her main team. So we've got face Daisy. Uh, we've got face Daisy, the first casualty for the day, and that is going to be Lily MV Manji taking off a long distance spray. Taking off a long distance break, confirming that kill for her team. So that is going to be the first pick for the day, and it's going to be, uh, it's definitely going to be, uh, it's definitely going to be a mixed up here. We've got team number two and team number, uh, we've got yes, we've exactly got, we've got a Sri Lankan team here. Yes, Savi getting knocked off. We've got Leisha, we've got Yashodara and Sally here as well. So that's going to be team number seven versus. Uh, Team number seven versus team number two. Actually, Sally getting knocked off again. Sally saw with both knocked off. Yashwadara just going in for that cover fire. She's gonna manage a knock towards Isha, but Leisha is going in for a huge flank. Probably gonna go in towards her teammates. Just try to help, uh, help and make some cover for her team. So Sally is gonna get revived. 
and I feel like uh, Savi might just Isha might get the revive as soon as possible as well. But Alicia's just gonna drive there, and she's yes, she's gonna go in for that. Uh, I think RDM Pikachu getting knocked off as well. A good, uh, a good retaliation fire coming out from team number seven. They were in a bit of a hot spot, but now they are finally regrouping themselves and going in for a better retaliation. Uh, the revive coming in soon towards RDM Pikachu Yashu that are going in for the flank, but not knowing that. Uh, team number two is BD7I. Rafi is right here. So she might just run into Yashodara anytime soon. Now she's definitely gonna take the long way around. And uh, Yashodara just going off after knock after knock. She's gonna get another knock there as well. Two knocks. Last man standing. Last girl standing actually. That's gonna be uh, Rafi. She's gonna get knocked off as well. And that's a full squad wipe coming out of team number seven. I think these girls are playing very, very good. We've got team number seven. They've got a nice player gun there as well. So since they're not in the zone yet, I'm pretty sure they just jump into the zone. There's no further looting. They just jump into the zone and just go in with that player gun. And that's a very good start. That's a very aggressive start for team number seven. That's quite nice, actually. That's quite nice. Uh, that's a very, very... Uh, Good start. We've got Goma Nippa taking off Bonnie kp 2 r The fight is on, ladies and gentlemen. We've got Goma Nippa here from team number 10. That is going to be team Girls of Glory from Sri Lanka. And we've got team number 6 here, team ORC Mermaids. That is also a Sri Lankan team. So it's going to be Sri Lanka versus Sri Lanka for the moment. And um, I think uh, Goma Nippa there somehow managing to get a kill. Bonnie kp 2 r getting uh, completely killed off. So that's going to be a 3v4 situation between team number, team number 10 and team number 6. So I think Minol is going to go in for that rotation. We've got Haley here. We've got Goma Nippa. We've got Zarina. We've got Shaira. And Minol is going to get knocked by Haley. Haley is going to get definitely going to get the uh, retaliation fire. Nice cover coming from, from Ritu on live. She's going to uh, take off Haley's knock. So she's just going to cover her teammates very nicely over there. And a couple of nades thrown in. The nades definitely not gonna hit. And Ritu on live. Get it. Trying to get surrounded. Serena gonna go in for that push. Hopefully. And Shaira is gonna go in for that flank as well. And Ritu on live being a bit open towards the Shai towards Shaira's area. Uh, Shaira completely killing her off. And Minoli trying her best to do some damage. To deal some damage. I think ORC Tiana. What she should do is definitely go in for that flank. Can she make it? Yes, guys. Tiana going in for that knock. Probably going to go uh, confirm that kill as well. It's going to be Shira versus Tiana. And she's going to get backstabbed just like that, guys. By Haley with that M16A4. And that's going to be a full squad wipe out coming out from team number team number 10, actually. They've got a casualty there. Serena getting killed uh, completely. But they've got four kills confirmed. But uh, in return, they've got themselves a casualty as well. But uh, that's a nice amount of loot. For them, I think uh, team number 10, they're probably lacking from loot here. They are, I think, uh, looking at Haley, she's got an M16A4 and a Thompson. So I think she's definitely going to go in for a switch for a better we a weapon, a be for a better 5-point weapon, actually. So uh, something like a, a Scarl or an M4, mostly an M4. So just because it's quite familiar, uh, just because it's quite, uh, quite uh, famous, actually. It's quite popular and famous among a lot of PUBG players. And... Uh, I mean, uh, with me as well, but I'm more of a 7-point guy, but I'm more of a 7-point guy, but you know, if it comes to 5-point, I definitely go with the M4 as well, but uh, mostly an M762 person, so, you know, <laughs> who knows, uh, but looking into it, guys, we've got 11 teams yet, we've got 11 teams, 2 teams completely wiped off, and a total of 39 players, so we've got IMB JLO here, we've got INB Nikki. So that's team number 8, team NA Invictus. They've uh, completely changed their, um, I think they've got their insignias there as well. So that is looking good for them. We've got Sednik, Babystar, Nikki and Jaylo. They're loading off Porchinki for the moment. And uh, they're quite...